Okay, so if you want to improve your pitching, here's a great little drill that you can do to improve your pitching. So a lot of people are pitching poorly and making bad contact because they're trying to manipulate the club. We don't need to manipulate the club. So one of the drills I love doing is the one-handed pitching drill. So what I find is if I start manipulating my hand, that leading edge digs in. Now when I get that leading edge digging into the grass, it, it hits it a bit chunky and the speed of the club stalls and I hit the ball a bit fat or a bit heavy or lay the sod over it. I think it's uh, also known as in America. What we really want to do is we want to engage the bounce of the club so that if we can get the bounce of the club, that back of the club hitting first, the club doesn't stall, it keeps the club moving. Now if I'm practicing my swing and I'm keeping my wrist movement to a minimum, in my mind I feel like I have plaster of Paris bandages around my wrist and it's dead locked. The reality is there's a little bit of softening in the hands. But in general, we just want to feel that that is a bit stiffer than normal. Now, one of the golf pros that has improved their pitching a lot over the last 18 months is Rory McIlroy. And I read recently that his coach has got him to hit a lot of one-handed pitch shots. It's really uncomfortable. You're going to hit some terrible pitch shots. You'll hit them fat. You'll hit them thin. Contact is going to be poor. It'll be embarrassing how bad you hit some of these shots. Try and work through that. You will get to the point where you will start making really good contact and you'll have good distance control. I think we should make training much harder than the real playing of golf. So if we can do it one-handed in training, how easy is it to pitch with two hands? But it does help utilize the bounce of that club. So all we're trying to do is we keep that wrist action to a minimum, keep, feel like you've got a firm right hand and locked into position. And from there, we just try and hit the shot. And that's not a bad result. So give it a go. It will help you improve your contact. And if you want to get better at golf, I'm going to put another link to a video just up there I know is going to help improve your golf.